Hi, Linz. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Jane. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Nikki. Hey, Jenny P is in the house as well. Hello. <laughs> I'm so excited. Hello, Kim. Diana. Hello. Hi. <laughs> And Sharon is coming in as well. Hi, Sharon. Hi. Daisy. Hi, Daisy. <laughs> Angel is in the house. Angel is still working home. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> and Nazreen. Nazreen, hello. Hello, everybody. Hey. Hi. Wow, look at all of you. <laughs> Have you got camera, Nazreen? So you I do. Right? I assume it's on. No, I can't see you yet. Oh, wow. Why? Um, try bottom left hand corner if you're from a PC. Camera. Video. Ah, hi. hi. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Thank you so much for joining the Speed Networking event. Thank you for inviting me. <laughs> so fabulous. Um, I'm going to keep an eye out on the right hand side because there may be some other neighbors calling in. So, but I, I'd like to be like about one hour maximum and I want, to, want us to get to know each other um, a little bit more. And of course, you know, we're going to share the links. I uh, hope you have prepared like a two minute um, two minute speech so that you you know we, you, we can get to know you very very quickly um i'm just going to do a little bit of an introduction uh and then i've got something really really special at the end so i really really hope you can stay to the end it would be fantastic because obviously we want to hear um everyone's story and uh, obviously hear what what each other do because that's you know i think that would be fair right if we if we all stay to the end i agree so fabulous, <laughs> thank you. Okay, so Deborah is coming in as well. Deborah, hi Deborah. Hi Sabine, hi. how are you? You are right? You got camera as well? I think <laughs> I do. Um, <laughs> how do I do, oh here. And the bottom, yeah. Hi. <laughs> Hello, hi. Fabulous. Yeah, I just said I'm just gonna do a very short introduction. Mm -hmm. today. It's literally, uh, I'm going to have my timer because there's 28 ladies booked today and I, I probably not everyone's going to show up. But if everyone was to come, then obviously we'd be really, really tight on the schedule and we'll have okay. like, literally like no more than two minutes. And there's Gloria. Gloria. Hi, Gloria. <laughs> Hi, sorry. Sorry, I'm late. <laughs> no worries at all. So it's so fabulous to have you. So let me just introduce myself a little bit because I know some of you ladies are new to Reach for Greatness and new to me as well. Um, some of you ladies already have been with me for quite a while. So I really, really appreciate you coming and hopping on as well. So Annika, Annika, hi. <laughs> fabulous to have you as well. So yeah, so mm -hmm. I'm Sabina Mataro and I am the host um, of Reach for Greatness TV and the founder of the Greatness Club and I guess the speed networking event sort of came to me as well as part of, hey, how can I help women become more visible and how can I help women come out of Facebook and sort of make some real connections? This is sort of my my, my sort of my passion I guess it's it's something that I always loved doing even when I was in corporate I was in corporate job before I did leadership training and coaching trainings I always was happy in those sort of environments but I was always the connector right I was like ah I, I know x y and z who can help you with this and like now in on Facebook and on the, in the online world I'm sort of the same I'm like I know this lady who does this wonderful thing I think you need to go and speak to her so maybe Sharon if you want to unmute yourself you can, you can test it. Give me a testimony for that. <laughs> I sent a few ladies your way recently. Yes, you are a connector. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. So, um, so I just want to introduce very briefly and um, obviously um, there's, there's I could probably talk a lot about I mean, one of the ladies who's joined me recently as a co-host and a co a 
TV presenter is Angel Christina, who is there right there. And I'm super, super proud because we are growing the Reach for Greatness TV um, very much. And we've got so many uh, ideas that we can do and help ladies like you be visible, come on the TV, come on the show, start to collaborate and we grow together. So this one arm is obviously the, the TV and I'll let Angel talk in a second as well. Uh, in terms of what it is that we do on the TV side of things. <clears throat> so, oh, someone's, maybe we'll, I'll just open up the microphone, Angel, because I've got one lady who says I can't get on, so I'll have to hop on to Facebook and just send her the link as well. So Angel, <clears throat> feel free to mute yourself and just position the, the Reach for Greatness TV and how the ladies can perhaps also get involved. And then I'll talk a little bit more about the, the, the broader uh, sense, vision in terms of Reach for Greatness and how they can get involved. Is that all right? <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. I think I should be okay battery wise and then I'll switch to the PC. So hi everyone. My name is Angel. I'm the uh, co-host of Reach for Greatness TV. Yesterday we had an amazing, amazing session with these five beautiful women where I was interviewing them and I have been a TV presenter. So it's really, really cool for me to do this again because I absolutely love it. And it really does um, expose you as a person in a, in a good way, obviously, and make you visible and make you more out there so that people get to know who you are, what your story is, and they obviously can get to know you and join whatever you are doing, whichever communities. Sabine and I met a couple of months ago and we clicked immediately, but we never knew what's going to come out of this. We had no idea at all. Then she got this idea for Reach for Greatness and she asked me to collaborate with regards to interviewing people. I'm like, I could do it in my sleep. Let's do this. <laughs> so I did join and it's been an amazing adventure. Honestly, I absolutely love it. And also with the speed networking event, I think it's such a genius idea that we can speak as human beings rather than just online. Sometimes it also gets a bit lonely. So it's a bit, you know, like, Bleh. and <laughs> to put it in a nutshell. And um, so we can just get together here, get to know each other. I already connected with a couple um, of you. I can't see you all at the moment because I'm from my phone, but I connected with Sharon. It was an amazing session. So thank you so much for the connection, Sabine. With so many others thank you for connecting me with gloria she was amazing yesterday as a speaker well done gloria you're amazing um so it's a really really beautiful place you make beautiful connections you get new clients i got to do trainings um yeah just name it and it's there so it's so so beautiful thank you sabine for creating this greatness and also for having the same values as i have and there's also the charity, which I will let you speak about that. It's just, it's just really, really great. Thank you so much, Sabine. Thank you so much. I just want to let you know there's a couple of ladies from your group on as well. If, for example, Linz, and I, I can't wait to hear her. Ooh, okay, <laughs> hi, ladies. I'll jump on the PC in a second if you can let me in. <laughs> yes, I will let you back in. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so this is the TV side of things. And um, because, oh, oh gosh, it was one of these things like when... You, I, I sort of was joking with someone. They say, this lady said to me, you've got to be more visible because I was hiding behind the laptop and I was working on my own. And, you know, and I was like, yeah, okay, maybe I should, but I'm not that sort of stage person. I don't really like to go on big stages. So I said, okay, maybe I could do something on Facebook. So I actually hopped on someone else's Facebook live marathon, which was like a 12 hour thing. This guy does it for 12 hours every Wednesday. So he's got amazing mm -hmm. stamina. And I thought, well, I could do something for women, not quite for 12 hours, mm -hmm. but, um, you know, let's do it. Let's do it. So it's, it's manageable for everyone, but it still has the same sort of impact. So the, the reach for greatness TV was born because I just randomly posted in somebody else's group full of speakers and said, well, who wants to be on my, on my, um, Facebook live marathon. So I had like 20 ladies in like <clears> two hours commenting on the post and said, I'm in, I'm in. I'm like, all right, I've got to do it. I've got to organize this now. So I'm thinking quite logically and I'm a, a, like a project manager by, by heart, really. So I started to put together some spreadsheets and some Google documents. I said, okay, you can book your slot and all that. So we actually did now eight, eight episodes so far. So Angel just came in and did the, the, the last one yesterday. So the, her first one. So we want to actually do this now on a weekly basis and really provide great value doing banners. We're doing Facebook ads as well. And we decided we also want to um, create this community. And this is why the next step was really, and uh, I'm not sure is Jenny, Jenny P is here. I need to thank Jenny P because she's actually the, 
the person who's really pushed me to do this. He said, can you create a community that is possibly the next step for the speakers where we can all meet up, where we can all be, become more visible, grow and collaborate. So I really went back and thought really hard, right? What can we do? Because, and thank you so much for sort of pushing me to do that. This is where I came out with the Greatness Club. I thought, okay, the club, what is it? It's a membership. Yes, it's a paid membership. But how can it be different to, to, the, to the normal memberships, you know, where obviously you may want to go into a marketing membership and you just learn about marketing. But then I thought, well, hang on. I'm so open and I want to have all the ladies with all the different talents coming to my platform and just be visible. And we have no rules. It's like we're having fun together, right? So I thought, well, hang on. There's so many things that we can actually learn. It's not just about business and reaching for greatness in life to me isn't just about business, but it's also about, about maybe being a good parent. Like I've got two children, so I want to be a good parent. Maybe, you know, Faith is here as well. She talks about, I mean, spiritual things, right? So I never reconnected with the spiritual side of things. And I really enjoyed what she was talking about. So it's like, how can I bring these little, like these other pieces to women? that haven't maybe been touched. And I know all of you have this one speciality area and maybe there's another puzzle piece that you might be missing. So I've created a whole library of information and we have like weekly events, totally different things happening inside the club. We even have fun things. And I know Angel's going to do a Zumba class <laughs> because she's a Zumba <laughs> teacher and maybe Linda's going to come in. She's going to, she's going to entertain us with, with, um, you know, her amazing music. And the more, the merrier, you know, I just want to... Wait. I can do a salsa class. Brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> amazing. But, you know, because quite often we, we, we are sort of getting into some sort of membership and it's like, oh my gosh, I've got to sort of watch all these videos and it's like, I'm behind, I need to do this challenge and that challenge. This is not the space I want to create. It's about creating true friendships coming out like this with the speed networking went. So I'm actually hosting this once or twice a month, right? And of course, it's about generating business. It's of course, it's about gen, you know, being more visible with the TV as well. So I've packaged it all up into one beautiful bundle, I would say. So, and I'm, I'm you know, I can, you can probably feel, you know, where I'm coming from with love and love and abundance. And literally, I'd love, you know, if you think this is the right place, you want to know more about, I'll definitely drop the link. I'd love you to come and join the club be on the TV, be on the speed networking event and come and do salsa. Let's do dancing. Let's talk about art or whatever, whatever you've got to offer. I know Vicky is going to come in as well. Vicky is our website specialist. And we're offering website clinics. I mean, Vicky, bless her. She's going to do like, she will coach four ladies on each of the calls, which is so valuable. And we, at the moment, we, you can get in for 19 99 pounds per month, which is so super, so, I mean, you know, you know who, who's going to get the coaching for that sort of money? Who's going to get speed networking every month for that sort of money? Because if I go networking on a, on a local basis here, I would pay for breakfast already like 20 pounds just for the one go. So we've made it like super, super accessible. So I think I've done my pitch and you know what I do. I will definitely, you know, put the link in for you ladies to come and join. If you have any questions, please reach out. You know where I am. Um, and I want to open, I want to open to you if anyone's got any, um, remarks. I mean, I know Vicky is in, in the, in the club as well. So if you want to start off and maybe just say a few words, that would be fabulous. And I think Kim's also in the club already. Sharon's in the club. Jenny's in the club. Gloria's my one-to-one -one client and is in the club as well. Faith is in the club. So yeah, you can ask those ladies as well, what's going on. And of course, Angel, you're in the club. <laughs> <laughs> So do you want to, do we, do we want to start Vicky? Is that a good place to start? Yeah. Yeah. I'm happy to. Yes. So um, <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm excited to be in the club because I just, I see it growing and I see so many fabulous people in there. So come on in and join us. Um, but I guess I'm sorry, I haven't um, been to any of the speed networking um, events yet. So I guess this is just a quick intro about yeah. who I am. Right. So um, I've been running my own online marketing agency since 2003 and then in 2014 I transitioned to working with coaches and therapists and I teach them how to create their own client attracting websites and um, the programs 
that I run, they're about rising above the noise, about thriving at entrepreneurship, they're about mastering technology with confidence, it's about accountability, staying on track, all that good kind of stuff. So I have a signature 12 week program which teaches coaches and therapists how to create their own successful <coughs> WordPress websites from scratch. Um, but I have a bigger vision and this is one of the reasons that I was really attracted to Sabine's club as well is because she has a bigger vision and is wanting to contribute to charities. So my bigger vision is working with entrepreneurial women um, in rural areas of Africa to just help them break the cycle of poverty. Mm -hmm. I'm passionate about helping entrepreneurs closer to home and I love to see coaches and, and therapists conquer their fears around driving their business forwards with confidence and realizing their dreams. But really my bigger vision is to be out there in rural communities and helping women bring businesses online and just helping them just break that cycle of poverty so um that's a little bit about me i don't know how long that took but um <laughs> it's under two minutes you've got 36 seconds left okay well, so, okay i'll tell you really quickly why my bigger vision is that for for africa because i spent um a lot of time while well, i grew up in west africa and then spent a lot of time in zambia living in a really rural community and the people there were amazing and it literally changed my life and so i want to be able to give back to those people who made such a difference to me and um, although WordPress seems so far removed from that, I know it can make a huge difference to people just through teaching them these skills about online marketing. Brilliant, I love that. And yeah, you're right, I completely forgot. There is, oh, that's it, two minutes. <laughs> Thank you. Well now, girls, you know how to model Vicky, that's two minutes. <laughs> Yeah, I forgot to say about charities. I mean, it's for me, it's important because I feel I can't stop war. I see all this stuff on TV. I actually just turn it off. I don't even want to watch the news anymore because it's so sad. And I know that, you know, when we can, we can give back in, 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 other, in other ways. And I think the, the, more, the more ladies that join the club, the more we can actually give back through charity. And what happened, there's already 50 ladies that joined within four weeks, by the way. So it's been growing really, really rapidly. And my vision is to get it to 500, 2,000 ladies so that we have a really lovely community. And, and obviously, a percentage will go to charity. We've already made donations of $400 this month alone in July already, which is amazing because you ladies have actually ordered not only the club, but I've also do, I'm also doing a PR service which is writing an article and then sending out to 500 news, um, online news uh, sites, basically, so that you can actually get a bit of PR. Not, not the traditional PR where you actually have to pitch to um, journalists, but it's, it's something that can be done within 48 hours and gives you lots and lots of um, links as well in, and, and um, advantages in the SEO arena because you, you're actually featured on a lot of news um, uh, news, news sites, so to speak. So that was one offer. I can also post that if you're interested, because I actually donated a whole profit out of that PR service into charity this month, and I'll do it again. I'm happy to do that. So, yes, and Faith, you you ordered as well, so we get you out there. You want to be next, Faith? <laughs> okay. Well, hi everybody. My name is Faith Rodriguez, and I am I'm a psychic medium energy healer and spiritual mentor. And so what I do in my sessions, I connect people with their loved ones that have passed, um, with pets that have passed, pets that are living. I can receive information that you have going on in your life or different areas that you um, need to heal. You're holding on to energy from something that you need to heal. And I channel energy healing um, to clear that. And I love helping other people to learn. Everybody's intuitive. So I really love helping other people to um, understand them and how they receive intuitively. And then I teach different tools that help people to keep their energy clear. And especially because a lot of people now, so many people are sensitive to energies. A lot of us are impasse and we don't even know it. So I love, love, love focusing on the energy healing and really helping people to keep their energy clear. Uh, so that's a little bit um, about me. Um, I love sharing. So I love if you have any questions, contact me. Um, and I really would recommend for anybody um, that's really looking for upgrading their business, 
uh, learning more tools for your business, really to join this group. It's wonderful. I love that the women are real. A lot of them are moms, so it's nice because you plan your stuff around with, with the kids. And in life, that's really how a lot of people are. So instead of seeing a lot of... Um, you know, a lot of stuff that's kind of like fake or, or programmed, I really think that this is real. So I really love the program and I would recommend it to everybody to just join this group. It's wonderful. So thank you. Thank you so much, Faith. <clears throat> you're like, you know, you know, you're like an angel to me. Uh -huh. I, I can recommend Faith. We had a, an amazing session. So anyone wants to connect, Faith is amazing. Yeah. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> What? Oh, that was two minutes. Fabulous. I think we're doing really well, girls. Uh, wave if you want to be next. <laughs> Do, you have a, Do you have a song? Do you want to hear? <laughs> Do you have more than two minutes because I'm, I'm, I love your music. Brilliant. Can't hear it. We can yeah. hear you. You can. So Sabine can hear me. Yep. Do I need to turn it up a bit? Is that any better? That's good. Yeah. That's good. Okay. Okay. We turned up. Um, hi, everybody. Nice to meet you all. This is this is my first time. I feel like a speed network virgin over here. So uh, thank you very much. <laughs> all of us are because I kind of invent. I, I thought I kind of invented it because people are like speed networking. I said, do you know speed dating? And they said, yes. Okay. I said, I've just sort of renamed it and I made it something else. <laughs> it's, it's a great concept. Uh, yeah. So I, I'm Linz. Hi, everyone. I, I am a songwriter. Um, I am a musician. Uh, I am a very proudly independent musician. So I don't want to be signed to a label. I don't want to go on X Factor. I don't want any of that. I write heart-centered lyrics that tell other people's stories. So a lot of the time, if I t say to people I'm a songwriter, they often say, oh, have you written for anybody famous? And I have, but I don't, I don't just want to do that. I believe everybody has a song in them. Um, and I have written for people f for lots and lots of different reasons. Uh, people who are in my Crichton clan, I have my own clan who help me to make music. Um, I want my Crichton clan to collaborate with me um, and there's a we, we, we recently did an EP together called We Made This which was right here um, and each week I record uh, demos of songs I email them to the Crichton clan and then in 2018 the first 90 days of 2018 um, I wrote loads of songs I sent them out to everybody and I got everybody to vote on the ones that they wanted on the next EP and they vote on artwork, they vote on the names, all sorts of things. Mm -hmm. Aside from that, I do write personalized songs for people, as I was saying as well. So if, um, I, I mean, I've written for people who have had cancer and, and the, the family members have wanted to write, for me to write a song to, to honor that person. I've written for homeless charities, all sorts of things. If you know somebody's getting married, for example, and you want um, a personalized song written for the big day, uh, that kind of thing. So. That's kind of what I do. Was that two minutes? There's no gold yet. <laughs> That's brilliant. Um, so yeah, would anybody like me to play anything, or is that going to take? Definitely. Yes, please. Yes. Okay. I'll, I'll very. Uh, this is why I've got my setup here. So Definitely. I'll very quickly do half a song. <sighs> Can you hear that? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Right. This is a song I wrote last week, very quickly. I was on Angel's stream. She's dragged me on to doing live streaming. <laughs> Thanks for that, Angel. <laughs> Learning to love the sound of my feet. Walking away from things that's just not meant for me. You can't be bitter and expect your life to be sweet. So grab your dancing shoes, let's walk to the sound of the beat. Now let's go. Turn up the volume of my so-called weakness. I kept falling for your heart. Damn sweetness, let's go celebrate. Cause I'm walking away, walking away.
Amazing. Very good. You are excellent. Goosebumps. Thanks. Your voice is Thanks. just amazing. So if anybody wants a song or anybody knows anybody wants a song, come connect with me. <laughs> do you have CDs as well? I do. I have CDs. Uh, my music's on Bandcamp. I have my website. Although, Vicky, from what I was hearing from your awesome IT technical skills, I can always do with WordPress help. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you could drop the link, that would be amazing where we can find your, your music. We can get a yeah. CD or something. Or, or iTunes, I guess, nowadays. I'm still old school CDs. <laughs> <laughs> Fabulous. Thank you. For having me. You're so super welcome. So happy to have you. So who should we go next to? Anyone in particular wants to go next? Not particularly. No, what they want to go. You already have <laughs> muted, Gloria. Right. I'll go next then. <laughs> right. Okay, I'll go next then. Hello, um, I hope, can you all see and hear me? Yes. Yeah, good. So I am Gloria Prest and um, I really thank Sabine for bringing me into this group. It has really made me to come out of myself and to be on screen, which was a real no-no to start with. So basically, I'm going to tell you what I do before I tell you my job title. Essentially, what I do is to update the equivalent of the software in people's minds. Mm -hmm because um, we have, we think we're logical, and we think we make logical decisions, but in fact, we're not, we're really emotional. And the decisions of everyday life, the small things particularly, is done so quickly that it's our subconscious that is the one that takes the decisions, and we just follow it. So that's why it's very difficult to break up with your eating habit, with your, whatever habit that you have, is ingrained in you, it's automatic. You go through it and you reach for it, automatically and your subconscious takes you away from the things that you or that the subconscious consider is nasty or not good for you mm. even if it's wrong so that's what i do i'm a hypnotherapist and a psychotherapeutic counselor is a bit of a mouthful so basically i am an integrity therapist and i integrate different techniques and different uh, stands from therapy to fit where the person is so just today i had a, a client who's signing to my um program for lost weight for weight loss and basically what we're trying to do is to make her to want to eat the things that are good for her to wish for those things rather than for the excess of sugar and unsuitable things that she has because she has a health issue as well as as wanting to lose weight so we're trying to change the mind so it agrees with the logical mind because she wants to do the right thing but her mind, her subconscious mind doesn't allow her to do it. So basically that is what I do. But I work with all sorts of different um, issues What you need to bring your subconscious mind in line to your mind. So that's it. That's what I do. Fabulous. And it's exactly nice. two minutes. Thank two you. minutes. Not bad. <laughs> Yeah, and Gloria is really fabulous what she does. Um, she's actually local to me. She's also one of my one-to-one um, one -one clients. So we actually meet each other almost every week anyway. And she's actually helped me overcome some of the issues as well in terms of weight related. So I can highly recommend her. And she knows, she knows everything, really. She knows exactly <laughs> how it works. She can, she can explain it. It's amazing. Thank you, Gloria. I'm a science geek. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> okay, um, should we go to Italy? Who is in Italy? Oh, lovely. <laughs> Paola. Here I am from, from Rome. Not so sunny today. <laughs> All right, so uh, hello, everybody. I'm Paola De Vescovi. I live in Rome, Italy. So if you happen to come to my country, I'll be very happy to to uh, show you around. Ah. Uh, Deborah I, is Italian too. Pardon Deborah me? Luzzi. Yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Ciao. Ciao, Bella. Ciao, Bella, yes. <laughs> so I'm a business and prosperity coach. Um, I, let's say, basically what I do, I help my clients to build a successful uh, business around their personal brand. So this is my core business. 
Um, I've worked for many years as a conference interpreter, so I bring into my coaching also my, um, my, the, the skills that I have acquired in my previous career, based especially listening very uh, carefully to the words that are spoken because words uh, do matter and they make an impression. And uh, also, of course, the principles of effective communication. But I've also worked since I was 19 with energy. I'm a Reiki master. And so energy work is also incorporated into my business coaching. So I must say that the approach that I have is really, uh, as we say, holistic, meaning that the person is at the very center of whatever we do. And also, um, I strongly believe that 80% of our success depends on our mindset, on our emotions, on our feelings, the energy that we project to the outside world so working on the person with the person in order to reflect this in the business is uh, my area of expertise two minutes oh, fabulous thank you so much did you talk about linkedin as well because you're link linkedin, LinkedIn yes. is you know the, the very central to my personal brand work so and it's the platform that you know has helped me create my business and promote my business and therefore it's my area of expertise yes in the personal brand area Molto grazie. prego prego <laughs> so should we go to deborah then next Hi. Can you unmute yourself? Yes. yes. But you're not so, in Italy though, isn't it? No, I'm in London. I'm actually, I've been living here for 23 years, so I feel more English than Italian. <laughs> wow. My English is better than my Italian, but anyway, uh, it's lovely to be here. I know some of you and it's I, actually just a few. I know Jenny and hi Jenny, first time that I see you. Finally, I meet you kind of. I know Sabine and Jill. And um, the rest, yeah, really nice to meet you all. Uh, so I'm Deborah. I'm a daring coach. Um, I help female entrepreneurs to dare more in their business and what it means to dare more, so to, to be a little bit more fearless, show up more, uh, and really be authentic. Because there is a lot of authenticity out there. Yes, I'm authentic. I do. I really speak what I, you know, my mind, and I, um, I do this and I do that. But when I work with women, I see that they are really shy, they're scared to ask for the sale, to connect, to do workshops. Uh, I have women that I work with that they wanted to always do a workshop and they never, you know, like, no, I can't do that. And then we work together and they do workshop and they love it and the challenges and all the kind. So I really, I'm a quite a daring woman, so I'm quite fearless. And I believe that we need to be out there, but not just this tiny bit and I don't mean loud but really uh, in a big way in a big way especially because if we want to serve in a big way we need to be there in a big way and so that's what I help women um, to do and the other things I have a group which is called women who dare to desire uh, it's a Facebook group and it does exactly what it says on a team so I really help women to kind of break get out of that box that egg and really show up so powerfully Wow. And that came up because I grew up with a mother, you know, it's in honor of my mother, she's still alive, but I grew up with a mother that she um, ruined her life. She, she's mentally ill because she always desired but never dared. So um, it's, yeah, I know it's two minutes, but I think it is really, it's deep in my heart to help every woman to be eight years old and to say, you know what, I don't regret anything. Um, That's amazing. Because, and I wish I could have done that with my mom, you know, but mm. yes. So this is me. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Um, and I think I'm just thinking back to the charities that we're supporting. Um, I made a direct connection with a lady called Sister Seth, who actually is in Pakistan and she works as a school teacher, especially for women and for girls because girls have no voice in Pakistan. And she was meant to come on a call with me and then she had to cancel and she said, I don't know if you realized, but one of my 
nine-year-old student had burnt herself and she's now critically ill in hospital whilst her own parents didn't take her to hospital and left her to die for one month being locked into a dark room. So my heart really goes out to those women as well in those countries who don't have a voice because they're being treated like that. And the next thing I hear is that even late baby girls are just being dumped on the street. Just babies are being dumped in Pakistan on the street. It's like, and this lady is right there actually helping the community and helping them, you know, formulate that voice and changing the mindset. So this is why I reached out and I said, okay, the part of the profits definitely will go to you. And she's just, yeah, amazing. So, and, and I appreciate what you do, Deborah, as well. It's, I mean, if I can add something very little bit, I do um, women meet at, like women's circle of women who dare to desire. And I have a really big vision. And one of the vision is to take this meeting because at this meeting is so powerful. Women really, they, you know, say what they want for the first time in their life. And even if it is, oh, I want to open a business, I want to leave my husband or whatever it is, it's often related to business. They say it for the first time. So I want to take this everywhere in the world. I mean, I'm going to be my first one in Colombia because I'm actually going on holiday next week. Oh. And I'm going to do my first one in Colombia. And, and it's so needed over there because women are as well, there's so much machismo and things. And so, yeah, I just, I want to make them worldwide. So it's a big dream. Love it. Fabulous. Thank you so much, Deborah. All right. Thank you. Fabulous. <clears throat> Uh, Jenny P. If anybody told me that I was going to be on a speed work, a speed networking call five years ago, I'd have said you were crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm really happy to be here. I was, I was, um, I was slightly on edge that it was going to be like everybody was going to like give me their elevator pitch. And you know, in a, and I'm so I'm so thrilled that it, it's all gentle and 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 soft and lovely, and real. So I'm I've um, so my elevator pitch is I'm not going to talk about it. So um, I'm Jenny Jenny P, um, aka the Dream Whisperer, and also I, and I'm a Dream Catalyst. I'm currently a um, mindset and lifestyle mentor. Uh, I've had a very, very rich life doing all sorts of things like horse dancing, being a fitness instructor, having a healthy gastronomy, uh, auberge, also, um, chateau restoration, um, all sorts of things. I'm currently working with um, on a, a TV reality series called Fix My Brand in America with Ali Craig on Success TV as a mindset mentor. But my, my real speciality is um, how, how I help people uh, most is what I've realized in, in, my, in my rich and very eventful life is that your why, your, your core message, your why is your, is your, in your zone of genius is, is the answer to everything. Is, it is also your, your most powerful manifestation zone. It's the, it's the, the place where you have your, your biggest, strongest client attraction. It's also the bit that aligns you with your own health and well-being. So I, because I'm a quantum, quantum, um, I'm a quantum junkie and I, and I research all the time, I found, I discovered um, a, a, quite a few years ago um, that there is, there is a code uh, in all of us, which which is related to the, am I done? Have I done two minutes already? That's what it was. Two, yeah, that was two minutes. <laughs> Gosh, I was I was trying to talk quickly. So, and let me just, if I can just finish. Uh, there's there is a code in each one of us that is related to the actual natural order of the universe, the natural the natural order of the whole cosmos, everything, nature, um, our DNA, the way we think, our habits, culture, everything is there is a natural order which is based on the power of three and i've actually discovered the code of creation um, that leads you to understand what what your why is what your soul soul message is and how to align that for a completely i mean kick-ass iconic lifestyle so and i'm really and i'm really proud to be writing the book and in the early stages of making a film about it wow Wow. That's amazing. 
but I do have I do have a page on Facebook, and I am and I'm working with people. If pe people want to want to um, come and find out m more about it, then then my Jenny P page is the, is a good place to start. I love I love the Trinity Code because he talked about that on one of the Reach Greatness TV series. So if you want to find out more, we'll get you the replay. I think he was one of the early ones, and in April we talked about the the Trinity. Yeah, yeah. So it was it was fascinating, really. Thank you. Good. So, um, I don't know who else. Diana, maybe? You want to be next, Diana? How are you, my darling? Do you want to, shall I unmute you? You're good, yeah. Are yeah, you doing it? <laughs> yeah. Hello. Uh, hi, yeah. Nice so, hello, everybody. Nice to meet you, Sabine. Um, oh, sorry. I'm talking over you. <laughs> um, so, um, yes, I uh, found you uh, through Angel because uh, Angel's one of her live video came up and uh, we know each other very well with Angel. And uh, so I thought, OK, I, I'm going to come on and I'll do this. And I'm really enjoying being here with everybody. Hello, because it's kind of for me the essence of everything. Um, I would like to be known as um, helping women to really live from their intuition and really follow their intuition. And I've got a special way of doing that. Um, my business is called Modern Goddess, Modern Woman, Ancient Wisdom Reclaimed. Um, I believe that we women got disconnected from each other thousands of years ago and uh, we need to reclaim that power. We need to reclaim our, I'm a, female empowermentist i don't like using the word feminism because it's been so tainted but i i believe in this when we we come together we support each other magic happens and we really need to do this so i love what you are doing sabine it's it's awesome and your name means freedom right so it's bringing yeah. that freedom back for everyone and um so this is my business uh, and it's all based on connecting with ourselves, uh, breaking the taboos. Like you say, in Pakistan and so many places, women are not, women are seen in the world as well as, as dirty or not talking about our stuff. And I like to help women to reconnect with the moon, with those ancient wisdom, with our um, menstrual cycles and live from that um, wisdom that is coming to us every day. Sorry. Um, yeah, this is it. I could talk about it for hours. Oh, I could feel so <laughs> passionate about it. I got goosebumps, and, and you're so right. Yeah, I think when women come together, lots and lots of magic happens. Sure. Yes, thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> I can see a hand up. I think Bridget's like, ah, I want to go next, right? <laughs> okay, <laughs> Bridget, yeah. yeah, gorgeous. Yeah, can you see me? Yeah. You can see me and hear me, all right? Yeah. Hi, Sabine. Hi, everybody. This is my first networking event I've been managed to get to on time, sort of. A um, little bit about me. I was talking yesterday on the event. So I'm a body positivity coach. So I'm all about similar to Diane and a lot of the women. A lot of the women that I've been talking already are similar, like themes, similar wavelengths as well. So I want to empower women and help women to be the best they can be as well. So it's not about what we look like, where we come from. We're all here in the world together. We're all trying to make our lives into our businesses. I, I believe in like making the most of who we are as a person. I know body positivity, a lot of people think about, oh, it's about being large or it's about being this, it's about being the other, but it's just about being a woman and owning who you are, owning your gifts and bringing them forth into the world, like letting your light shine. And my overall vision has always been to give back and help women as well which I like the aspect of giving I've lived in poorer countries I've seen the way women are treated in that as well and we're treated like second class citizens we're the giver of life like without men like without us men don't exist and men forget this and they try and put us in our boxes and we rise up strong against them and they don't like it and but I want women to be happy and to love the body they have and to embrace who they are. Like your body has done all these amazing things for you in your life. And it allows you to do these things. We just forget. But the other aspect as well, if we're not confident and owning in who we are, it'll transfer into our businesses. And we're trying to get to work with people and people to trust us and to do different things. But we don't feel good about ourselves. That will project out into the world. And it's like energy doesn't resonate with other people. Then it, 
you'll feel off and nobody wants to go through life feeling miserable about themselves it's only your weight or your looks it's not the end of the world you know looks fade and weight doesn't really matter at the end of the day but my big vision is to host retreats which I'm hosting my first one in October called the goddess retreat so it's leashing the inner goddess within and celebrating what it means to be a woman so fabulous thank you please share the link and um, it's so true yeah. what you say about our bodies, how our bodies look and what our bodies do for us. We actually forget about that. And anyone who's got children will probably know what the bodies are capable of to actually create such amazing, you know, human beings as well. So. Yeah, we just discount a lot of things we can do. And as women, yeah, we're very powerful, like givers of life. You know, not everybody can do it. And the women that do it and have business and mums and do everything for everybody else and you forget about yourself so that's the other aspect I want to bring in the self-care part to women as well that we need to make time for ourselves even if it's only 20 minutes a day to grab a coffee and a notebook and write some ideas down yeah. it's just taking time out of your day for yourself and being able to run your day then because if you don't have a plan then you're just day just gets scattered and you waste time doing nothing so brilliant thank that's you that's so it for me and thank um, you and yeah ladies just connect with each other see like diana wants to connect with you bridget and i know some other ladies want to connect with each other and that's the whole essence of coming together today to make those fabulous connections yeah um should we go to kim kimberly do you want to be next my lovely How sure are you? <laughs> are you good absolutely um so I am Kimberly Wiggins and I am in, I feel like everybody else is somewhere else. <laughs> and so I'm in the U.S. You're I'm in, in Georgia. Um, um, I think Faith is from the U.S. I'm not sure who else. Yes. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yes. But it's, it's just really nice to be that you brought us all together to connect us from around the world. That's mm -hmm. oh. Oh, so nice. Thank you. I help women entrepreneurs who are trying to escape their nine to five and actually build a business that they love so they can live the life that they love. My um, greatest passion behind all of this is actually being able to help women, mothers especially, see that they do not have to leave the home to be able to create an income for themselves and live the life they wanna live and enjoy their families. You know, I talked to so many mothers who are feeling mommy guilt from dropping their kids off at daycare and, and just um, not being able to spend time with their families. I, my focus is bringing mothers back into the home. You have the brilliance already inside of you. So all I'm trying to do is help you keep that brilliance at home. So you can still cover your income and contribute to your family in an even more powerful way. Um, and so in addition to that, um, you know, I do regular coaching, but I also have a podcast. It's called Bye Bye Nine to Five, where I interview women that are already doing this so they can inspire other women. I also have a... I think Kimberly's breaking up. Yes. Okay. Maybe we'll get her, her on later when she's back, just to finish off. <laughs> it's difficult, isn't it? That person who talks, a bit, the internet just plays up. I think it's energies. I, I have felt this on a couple of calls where we were we actually doing some uh, meditation and things like this, where the internet really is playing up because of the energies in the room. And I think this room is on fire, right? <laughs> That's why the internet's a bit yeah. hazy. Yeah. So shall we go to Jane? Jane's been waiting there. Lovely in pink there. Hi, Jane. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I've never done anything like this before. And um, I feel a bit nervous, actually. Uh, I discovered uh, the link for this um, in the middle of the night. <laughs> I couldn't sleep. I thought, oh, yeah, let's be dynamic. We'll, we'll get back to you. Do, do you just want to maybe drop... Do you, uh, want, do you want Kim to finish? Kim? Kim, you can you just drop your, your link and then we'll probably catch up with you when your internet's I think I'm, Yeah, I'm not, not sure where I left, where I dropped off at, mm -hmm. but, you know, pretty much I was 
just saying, I, I do have a podcast where I interview women who are already doing this. I'd love to have some of you ladies on my podcast. And I also have a group I've just started calling Women Speak Their Truth because it gives women a, an opportunity to actually um, come in a group like this and actually speak their truth and for us to help and support each other. And um, I'm not sure if you guys caught it when I said I was in a, I have a subscription box business as well. It's an activewear. And so that's about it. Fabulous. Thank you, Kim. You broke up a little bit, but maybe you can just leave um, the information in the chat so the ladies can connect with you. Yeah. Fabulous. Thank you. So Jane, let's go back. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so it's the first time yep. you, you, yeah, you're here. I hope yeah. you're enjoying it. Yes. Yes, I am actually. It's, it's not what I was expecting. I actually thought I was going to be chatting with local ladies from the local area because I got the link off ladies who latte in Marlow. Yes. <laughs> And I'm local. I'm, like lo I'm local, and I know you're local to me. Are you? I'm High Wickham. Yeah. All right. Okay. So I thought it was just going to be very local ladies. So um, and it's Gloria amazing to meet all these people, though. Gloria is local. She's in Windsor. Oh, are you, Gloria? Oh, nice to know. In fact, I do. I, I am also a, a hypnotherapist. I'm a solution focused hypnotherapist and psych psychotherapist. Um, but I don't do the same method of hypnotherapy as Gloria. Um. So I have a background in nursing and midwifery. Uh, and as I said, I work in High Wycombe, but I, I do home visits to surrounding areas for those who want home visits. And um, I work out of the Lotus Centre in Bourne End as well on a Monday evening. So I totally love what I'm doing now. I've done various career changes in my life, um, but I just love what I'm doing now. And I can't wait to find out more and more about it, actually. Um, what's so nice is you can give a gentle nudge to somebody to get their lives back on track. And that's what I really love doing. You know, you can get somebody in the door who, who's seriously anxious or seriously stressed and they're in tears. And a couple of weeks later, they're going out with a lovely big smile on their face. And so it's a very rewarding thing to do. Um, basically solution focused in therapy is, um, it's all about moving forward. I don't do much trawling through the past or looking backwards. It's all about moving forwards, which is really lovely. And as with all hypnotherapy, you know, we use the relaxed state and the power of suggestion for, for dealing with any particular issue. So I obviously get quite a lot of stress and anxieties through the door, which is, is, is a lovely one to do because we get, you know, very quick results, which is lovely. But I have exam nerves and performance nerves and um, migraines. Migraines have do quite well with me actually <laughs> um, but I, what I like to do rather than just doing hypnotherapy sessions I like to provide tools to help people so I obviously give relaxation recordings I sometimes do personalized um, CDs and I like to give people tools and tips to how, how to actually cope when they're, they're anxious and how to deal with their lives I do adults children and teenagers which are all very different and all yeah. can be quite challenging <laughs> um, but what's nice I give everybody um, a free first appointment so they can we can find out what each other are like and whether we're going to get on with each other and so they can find out more about what it's about and so they can decide whether they want to sign up or not my, my beat, beat went off didn't it yes do you <laughs> okay. do online consultations as well can you yes i'm i'm developing zoom at the moment so i've just recently got my own account and i actually met met a lady in a field at uh, love supremes festival and she needs some help. So I said, right, I'm setting up my Zoom. We'll do some sessions. She's in London. So I'm going to do some over there. So I'm, I'm really hoping to get the Zoom off the ground, actually, because it's really good for, for doing it now. So, yeah. Oh, so I love what I do. Um, it's been lovely to speak to, to people from all yeah. over the place, actually. Well, we, maybe we should just meet up, buddy. Me, you, Gloria. It'd be brilliant. Absolutely <laughs> brilliant. I love it. I love it. That's Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I think we, uh, there's a theme here. I know, yeah. <laughs> you know the lady who will go next will know who I am speaking to if there is a theme. <laughs> Hint, Sharon. <laughs> I thought, uh, yeah, I feel like um, you were just doing what I was going to say because <laughs> I'm a hypnotherapist too. And I just love the tool of meditation and hypnotherapy. I, I, it's just amazing. Like you were saying, I've seen people, um, this one woman, she had suicidal, she'd had three suicide attempts 
and for whatever reason, she didn't want to um, go any other route. And her partner said, you have to do something. So I lived a few doors down and she did hypnotherapy. And let's see, 10 sessions. She, she was totally free of that. It's just like, oh my gosh, this stuff is amazing. So I'm a real fan of uh, meditation hypnotherapy. Uh, I love Sabine. I, I don't know how long we've known each other, but already you've connected me with different sample sessions. And I've got to, uh, I love the networking last time. Uh, I got to uh, do a little sample session with Angel. And it's like, oh my gosh, these are such beautiful, heart centered women. So sorry I couldn't say anything before, but I was just waking up because I live in Idaho in the United States. And this started at six o'clock in the morning. So. It's like, no, no, I need my coffee. Um, uh, how I ended up going this route of hypnotherapy was looking for solutions to, um, I loved what Deborah was saying about, it's like she's brave and daring. And I was the total opposite of that. I grew up in a family with lots of depressions and illnesses. And I, I was introverted and scared and fearful and afraid. Um, uh, so it, it led me on this path of it's, there's gotta be a better way, a better way than taking a pill or, um, uh, different doctors. And, and to me just discovering everything is possible. So, uh, it, originally I started working with people with depressions, anxieties, illnesses, and just kind of amazed that it's, is my time off. Oh yeah. <laughs> it is. Well, that that kind of gave a smattering of what I do. Now I'm working with um, women to achieve their dreams. And uh, just real quick, like with Sabine, we're working together. Um, and what I love is whatever topic it is, uh, it's, it's about empowerment and freedom. So that, uh, and I'm sure all these women know that too, that uh, no matter what you work with people on, it's really about that empowerment and freedom and creating our lives so thank you thank you Sharon you're amazing Fabulous. thanks um so you go to Daisy hello Daisy wie geht's hi everyone From Germany thanks for having me I live in London yeah. though for most I'm of awesome my life and we speak <laughs> German we can speak German <laughs> <laughs> More Londoner than German, though. <laughs> Hi, everyone. It's nice to be here. It's been um, lovely to uh, hear everyone's um, background and see what you, what beautiful businesses you're all creating. Um, I help women like you to make peace with their wardrobes. And the reason I do that is because I realize that um, if we want to upscale our businesses and our, we want to really step into the, the, the woman that we can become tomorrow, how we dress on the outside and how we feel on the inside about how we show up in the world um, is a really powerful tool and can be amazing business strategy to really hone in on your personal brand and really be genuinely authentic, consistent and dress with purpose. So that's um, how I help female entrepreneurs um, with their business. That was a quick, sorry, that was a quick two minutes. I don't know what I did. Maybe I turned it on too early. That's okay. It felt, it felt quicker than two minutes. Oh, that's fabulous. So do you do online um, coaching? Yeah, you, you can reach out online to women and help them find their styling. Um, some of my work has to be done face to face. Mm -hmm. So, um, my signature program is 12 weeks long with three, um, face to face visits. So, um, I do a lot of the work online because a lot of it is mindset and how we feel about our clothes and a lot can be learned and discussed, um, over a conversation, but there are certain elements that have to happen face to face, like a color analysis, body shape analysis, personal style, identity. That's one, one visit. Um, I also look into your wardrobe and shop from what's there so that we build outfits that really meet all the criteria we established in the first visit. And then it's a case of personal shopping and 
filling in those gaps um, in the third visit. And along the way, I look at color psychology, um, style demons, um, things that are holding you back from wearing what you want to wear, and also how you can then create certain looks depending on your audience. So especially if we're um, entrepreneurs and we speak from stage or we um, go networking or we have a certain client that we're going to see, that might be that might adjust how we dress for that day while still being true to our signature. So that's really um, my zone of genius to make that very powerful, to always be recognizably you, but still adjust it to your audience so that you're sending the right message. Even if you went mute, right. they'd still know what you're about and who you are and react with intention because your clothes talk. So whether you let you influence that or not, that's up to you, but they will send a message. So um, very much for um, doing that deliberately and sending the right message so that your um, audience can get the right and first impression and long-term impression as well. Fabulous. Thank you so much, Daisy. I think that was a very well-rounded um, explanation and, and you really highlighted the importance of having a personal brand as well. We as business owners and entrepreneurs, most definitely. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, for two more ladies. So I don't know, it's Annika and Nazreen, I think. Just checking everyone else had a go. So we're almost done, ladies, and we're in kind of on time. Yeah, two minutes over. Who wants to be next? Um, Annika or Nazreen? Yeah, either <laughs> go, Nazreen. I'll go. go ahead and go. Yeah. Good morning, everyone. Hi, nice to meet Hi. you. You too. I'm Anika, and I recently moved from Florida to Alabama this weekend. Um, and I am a life coach, but I really consider myself a success coach. Um, my my brand is based on fighting adversity. I have 20 years of social services work. I'm a psychologist and I've been a drug counselor, a child protective investigator. I just love to help people break free. And it's been a passion of mine. You know, I was a correction officer in my first job and I was timid, I was broken, I was lost. I've just spent 20 years of just building myself up and now trying to figure out how to make it a business and do what I've always loved to do and finally, being comfortable and having my voice and teaching other people to have the same. So it's, it's definitely a breath of fresh air to be amongst powerful women doing the same thing across the globe. It's just amazing. And I just want the world to see that we're here and you know, they can be the same thing. So looking at hypnotherapy, I, I recently work in addiction and I'm just watching people suffer from suicide, addiction, abuse, human trafficking. And I hear it's kind of similar across the, the globe of just looking at the oppression and just finding my place in, and, you know, working in that movement and just positive change moving forward and just empowering and educating and enlightening women. It's, that's just what I, that's just my passion and what I love to do. So I'm just getting started. I've, been in business about five months and I just opened a nonprofit yesterday. So what's a nonprofit? The nonprofit is going to be basically um, a one-stop shop of homelessness, transitional living, therapy, nursing consults. Um, I, I just moved from a melting pot in Florida where there was a lot of um, immigrants and, and what's going on right now, it's not good. But I did, did notice that cultures stick together and they don't ask for help. So I happened to be a ministry leader at my church um, when I was living down there. And I want to use that platform to kind of break the mold between all the cultures and get everybody to get help, to understand that you can ask for help and that services are there and to try to close the gaps because people think that calling 211 and things like that just solve problems and they don't. Yeah. Yeah. Brilliant. Thank you. Where are you going? <laughs> Jenny had to leave. Thank you so much. That's amazing. Can you um, leave your information as well? So if anyone wants to get in touch. Definitely. Collaborations. Yeah. Fabulous. Nazreen, last but not least. Definitely. <laughs> not least, okay. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Um, I've just gotten so carried away listening to you all that I even forgot to uh, connect with you on chat. 
Uh, it's been such a wonderful uh, experience being here for the first time. So thank you for inviting me. And really from the bottom of my heart, congratulations to you all and really kudos for what you do because uh, it, it, it isn't really easy for women out there and I, I, I salute what you do. Just a little bit about myself. I'm quite new to everything right now. Um, I am a, an ESL teacher in Turkey and um, on the, uh, about a year ago, I started uh, my own little business in leadership. Um, and so I am a coach, a trainer, and a mentor online. Uh, but I'm also the author of three phenomenal books. And uh, just today, I uh, relaunched the business, and uh, it's moved from what I used to call best version of your passions to Ignito, uh, because uh, my last book, and my favorite word is Ignite, and that's the last book that I wrote, Ignite the Champion Within and Inspire Others to Begin. Um, I'm currently completing my fourth book, um, and that one's a little bit different from the rest uh, in that it's going to be um, developmental, it's going to be self-developmental, but it's going to be in poetry. Okay, so that's a little bit different. Well, I'd like, uh, it's, it's actually uh, quite interesting to hear from you all uh, because I'd like to extend myself and my services to every one of you in any way that I can help. Um, currently, I'm also working on a project for divorced women or separated women who would like to lead themselves uh, either into a better relationship with their spouses or out of the relationship if that is necessary. So I'd like to take what I know about leadership and adapt it for women, and that's what I'm busy with. Uh, on the other hand, I can also help you if you are busy writing your books. I can go stride for you. That is what I do. And I proofread and edit professionally as well. So it's a pleasure to meet you all. And I think that's my two minutes up. Fabulous. Nazreen, thank you. Thank you for bringing this up. And I think I'm just going to summarize and round this up and then let, leave you and love you. But actually, um, we are going to write a book in Reach for Greatness. And it's about 100 women that have reached for greatness in their life. So if you'd like to be part, obviously I'd in invite you to come in and uh, I will develop obviously the proposal in the next couple of months. And uh, yeah, and I believe we can be, we can be bestsellers because if it's a hundred of us um, promoting this book together, we can all be bestselling authors. That's my vision. So, Wonderful. I'd love to. Thank you. Thank you so much. And thank you all ladies. As I said, if you stick to, to the end, I've actually got a very, very special invitation, a special surprise. I'm actually running um, a free webinar uh, on the 20th, uh, so next Thursday. And there's also another option if you can't make it on the 27th. And I can send you the link because my business has literally exploded in the last 90 days. And I want to give back. I want to actually tell my story a bit more because I've actually been trapped in shiny object syndrome. I was going round, round circles. I haven't really found my magic for a long, long time. And only now I'm feeling like, wow, I've come out, I'm doing what I love doing. And I've got, I get the feedback as well. See, I mean, just the fact that you all guys showed up today is just amazing. So I'd love to extend an invitation for you to come and learn more. Of course, in the webinar, it's called how to uh, accelerate your business in 90 days. So uh, I'm not sure I can drop the link here, but it's also on my Facebook profile and I'll probably just follow up with you ladies as well. And if you want to join the club today, it's only 19.99. It won't be 19.99 forever. So I'd love you to come and join us and we'll do more speed network working events. We'll get you on the Reach for Greatness TV. We have also podcasts where you come on to and perhaps book the magazines and loads of opportunities to connect and also be learning all kinds of different things, Zumba, Salsa, and you know, what have you, right? So I think you get the gist, because you've been here today and kind of know what's happening inside the It's me and, and Angel <laughs> entertaining you. <laughs> so thank you so much, ladies. So and Bean, before you go. Or any more comments, of course you can, just can, can people share their their links on um i don't know how how do you do that on the your facebook page um 
Because so, I would love to learn more about the people, but and I couldn't really follow the chat because it's just yeah. too far away. I've, I'm, to I'm, I, I've got the, early log, in the morning. chat log. I have got the chat log. Um, of course, also inside the club, we have um, a place where all the coaches um, put their information as well. So we'll actually get together through that. Um, but I will be able to just maybe email you the chat log. Is that an option? Yeah, because it comes off soon. Yeah. Anyway. I've got a recording of this as well. So I might, I'm not, I'm, I don't think I'm, I'm connected with everyone on Facebook yet. So feel free to just um, add me as a friend and then I can maybe point you in the direction of different things on Facebook as well. So, and I also, I mean, I do have your email, so I can send it out. Any more comments before we, we leave? say one thing first of all thank you for being for the space it's just so beautiful to not only meet women from all over the world but to share our gifts this is something that when we discover our gifts and we decide to finally share them with the world and get value back for them by exchanging them it's just you know the best thing happens so thank you so much i honestly can't wait to interview you you have such beautiful stories you all have your own story and your own journey that brought you here i'm really really excited thank you for sharing and speaking here and you know for some of you it was the first time talking about yourself or you just started something new or you've been doing this for a long time so beautiful and well done sabine for creating this space for us to be here. thank you so much and thank you for coming on as well because i know you know it, it's a new environment and not everyone's kind of comfortable to be on video and sort of like what's going to expect what what is what's going to happen in this sort of meeting so i'm really really glad and i'd love you to also spread the word there's another speed networking event on the 1st of august so if you know anyone who would love to come and join some of your friends maybe invite them yeah so lots of love lots of love to all over the world reach for greatness let's share the love <laughs> Bye, ladies. Bye, everyone. Bye. 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 Bye.